The COVID-19 pandemic put winter and spring sports on a college level on halt, but it also did the same thing for high school sports like baseball, softball, track and field, and lacrosse. Our very own Kayla Carlisle caught up with some local standouts, and she has more. It feels like it's the same story every day. How has this pandemic impacted your program? And you know, the answer is usually the same. For players and coaches right now, it's all about accepting the unavoidable reality of not being able to play this season. But for the Bob Jones lacrosse team, this time is being used as more of an opportunity than anything else. Jack Haley is a senior at Bob Jones High School and has quite the resume when it comes to the sport of lacrosse. But now that the senior season is cut short, Jack is also missing out on another opportunity to represent Team USA in the student athlete world team competition, which was scheduled this summer in Spain. I mean, it, it obviously stinks not being able to, to play the rest of the season. You know, I was kind of looking forward to that. I'm going to play in college. Uh, so it's not like it was my last season ever. For the Bob Jones team, dealing with the loss of a season is just a minor concern when compared to the big picture. I want that for them. Uh, you know, I kind of want that overall high school experience, but these are kind of very surreal times. So, you know, I, I can kind of turn that off and be like, I, I want that for them. But then the next minute it's like, man, I just wanted to be safe. Coach Burke has coached lacrosse at Bob Jones for 11 seasons. He says there's always a silver lining in these tough situations. If you could do some sort of team building for this, this would be the year to kind of set it up. High school lacrosse is still an unsanctioned sport in the state of Alabama. However, we do have four seniors who are heading to play at the next level. From Bob Jones, of course, we have Jack Haley heading to Norwich University in Vermont, and then his teammate Austin Hall is heading to Tennessee Wesleyan. Then finally, we have two guys from James Clemens and Huntsville High who are both going to go play at Montevallo. Their names are Gary York and Brandon Evans. Mo.